Firefighters are watching for wind, and as Fox 11's Tracy Lair reports, fire stations are increasing their staffing to respond quickly. The flags that are flapping at the Montecito Fire Protection District appear to be the calm before the windstorm. One while the Station 2 flag is straight out blowing in a heavy wind. So. The wind is likely to push the moderate arrow to high at the Montecito Fire Danger Sign around the corner. Here in Santa Barbara County, we're really proactive with upstaffing in these events. And here in Montecito, we're bringing on two additional fire engines tonight, plus an additional chief officer, another battalion chief. So we'll be upstaffed through actually Wednesday morning. And same with Santa Barbara County and uh, Carpentry and many other resources and, and agencies in the county. High winds can make it difficult for high profile trucks and cars. They can also blow down trees. Probably just put my plants inside, close my windows. Have you ever had them knocked over? Oh yeah, definitely. They're very strong winds that come through. Normally practice might get canceled if, uh, if it was too windy. In the past, winds would cancel outdoor plans, but during this pandemic, many people are already staying in. If you get a power shutoff warning, it means the wind in your area will be strong enough to blow down power lines, sparking fire danger that's already impacted by dry conditions. This event is actually more Santa Ana related than Sundowner related, so, so it's driven by a little bit different force and, and we're just not seeing it yet. The goal of all the watches and warnings is so that you're not caught off guard. In Carpinteria, Tracy Lair, Fox 11 News.